Hello everyone, today we go over conservation of mass. Previously we talked about conservation of mass and the rate of change of mass within a volume like this volume. We have flux in, flux out, we have accumulation within the volume due to sources and sinks. Today we will study the rate of change of mass within a control volume. The control volume is an ideal volume fixed. We use it to study the accumulation of mass within it. So let's assume we have a control volume like this one. The volume of this control volume is B. Also, we have mass within this control volume of concentration C. So, the rate of change of mass within this control volume with time equal flux. due to effective plus flux due to diffusion plus minus source sink let us assume we have an area of DA and we have flux out of the control volume V. We are interested in studying the flexes in normal direction to the control surface. So let's assume the normal direction to the area DA is this one small and so the velocity component of V in the direction of N is V dot N this control volume is located within Cartesian co coordinate as shown and here this is the X axis Y axis Z axis the velocity in the x axis is u and y axis v and z axis w. Based on this setup, we can derive the transport equation. We can write the mass in terms of concentration. C times D, D, and we integrate this over control volume. This is the mass within the control volume concentration times volume. Equal. We get this form.